Andres Seidel for Porsche, how are you preparing the 2016 season to the extent that the goal is of course to keep number one? Well, first of all, it's obviously a great, great honor for us and uh, we are very proud that we go with number one and two on the grid this year. Uh, but it's important as well now for the team that uh, we leave uh, 2015 behind us, it's history. We have set uh, some high, let's say, ambitious goals again for the development of the car for 2016, but also for the way how we want to progress as a, as a, as a team. Um, at the moment, we are obviously working hard to, to achieve these, these targets, these goals, and uh, all is, is looking good so far. And uh, so we hope we are in a in the position to be competitive right from the, the first race again. What are the main evolutions on the 2016 version of the 919 Porsche? Well, I think there's there's not a, a single main evolution or revolution. Uh, similar to last year, we are, we are quite happy with the basic concept of the car, which means uh, the new car is again more an evolution in total. Um, Alex Hitzinger, our technical director, and his guys, they they worked again on really every single part of the car. Uh, the package is together now, and uh, we started testing uh, the new package, and now it's it's all about uh, getting the maximum performance out of this, this package and make sure as well that the car is reliable from the, from the first race onwards. Two cars instead of three last year, is it a sort of frustration for you? No, no, not at all. The decision was made together with, uh, with Audi. Um, for cost efficiency and uh, in the end we have all now the same chances uh, when we start the race in Le Mans, uh, Toyota, us and Audi, they, we all have uh, two cars at the start and uh, in the end it's, it's just uh, even more motivation for us to do, to do good. Last question, what do you think of uh, the presentation of today, I mean the entry list for the WEC and of course for the Le Mans race? I think it's, it's uh, sensational uh, what we have seen today again uh, for the ELMS, for the WEC and, uh, and also for Le Mans. I think it shows as well that uh, Pierre um, and uh, Chara are doing a sensational job. I mean, uh, looking at us, we are, we are really happy to be part of the, of the WC of, of Le Mans. Uh, we think the, the, the LMP1 regulations in particular, they are a perfect platform for us, for Porsche, to develop future road car technology. And uh, obviously the best way of using the platform is by winning races, uh, to show our customers as well that uh, the competence we have. and. Uh, we hope for, uh, we obviously hope that uh, we can be competitive again this year.